Right then guys, I've just got back from uh, a little bit of a ride out on the on the GSX S1000 uh, just a, a little update, I've done the throttle tube modification which uh, apparently is the the throttle tube out of the new Katana um, well, what a difference it's, it's the bottom end is so much smoother it's not long like trying to jerk itself out of your hands anymore with because the the throttle was so snatchy um, but yeah it has really smoothed it out it's a massive difference I wouldn't say it's perfect but uh, yeah I, it's gone from being well say just terribly snatchy go over a bump and the bike tries to accelerate out of your hands it, uh, but it, it no longer does that uh, it's now I mean, we can call it sensitive we can call it uh, um, what else could we call it yeah precise but it's no longer the, the, the snatchy thing that it did that it used to have so yeah if you haven't done it yet it's well worth a go uh, I fitted it myself I, I didn't know what I was doing I hadn't done one before uh, I, I did it I suppose in about 20 minutes my son's a, a Suzuki mechanic at the local dealers and he reckons they do them in about 10 minutes so uh, definitely definitely well worth a go uh, anyway yeah the bike's done about 170 miles I brimmed the tank before I left uh, it's done about 170 miles it says it's got 10 miles remaining it's average 52 miles to the gallon which for me brilliant brilliant I had, the, I had the petrol in the garage from the track day yesterday not on this bike I hasten to add um, so yeah just brimmed the tank and I've been out so about 170 miles on it and uh, bike's faultless can't fault it uh, so yeah well pleased anyway give that uh, give that throttle mod a go and uh, I'll uh, keep you updated with anything else that I do to it thanks very much cheers thanks for watching and like and subscribe thank you cheers bye